when we talk about how good is your service, yeah. we can easily talk about it from our point of view. In other words, the service provider, we did it on time. We did what we said we were going to do. We met the service level agreement. You know, the contractual terms were complete, etc. That doesn't speak about it from the client's point of view. That doesn't give us an, a language to really appreciate what's their opinion, what's their perception, what's their experience about the service that we provided. So I came up with something called the six levels of service. And let's start sort of in the middle. If you do what you said you were going to do and you fulfill the conditions of satisfaction in the contract, let's call that expected. It's just normal. Huh? Now, in the old world, 30 years ago, there was a fallacy that said that if you fulfill, if you meet expectations, you'll produce customer satisfaction. And the fallacy was that a satisfied customer would be a loyal customer. Ooh, remember those days, all right? Now anybody in digital marketing knows you can satisfy a client, does not mean they're gonna stay with you and be loyal. So that level of expected, not good enough. But before we go higher to what would be good enough, let's see what's below it. If you don't fulfill expectations, if you don't do you know the, the normal, but you do the minimum, in other words, you fulfill the contract, but the experience for the client wasn't very nice. What does that mean? You were late, you were inaccurate, and then you fixed it. Your mm -hmm. people were not polite. You did the job, but you didn't give the explanation, so they weren't sure about it, and they had to come chase you. Hmm? Mm -hmm. So that would not be expected. That would be what I call basic. So it's bare minimum. They got what you prompt, you know, but it wasn't a nice experience. If we go below that, you violated the legitimate minimum expectations. You didn't keep the service promise. And I call that level criminal. So now you got criminal, meaning you broke the promise. Basic. You delivered the bare minimum and expected, just normal. Now that's not where a digital marketing agency wants to be in the heart or in the mind of a customer. So let's go up. Above expected is when you serve somebody the way they like it the way they hope for, the way they prefer. And I call that desired level of service. So for example, you probably have some clients who prefer to get everything by email, but then there's others who wanna to talk to you on the phone. Right. And then there's others who say, no man, I live in WhatsApp. Come on, give it to me, or send me a text. You'll get some people who say, just stick it in the Google sheet. And other people say, nah, I don't wanna get it there. I want you to give it to me in some other manner. So it's the yeah. same outcome you're providing, the same digital marketing activity you're doing on their behalf, but the way you're serving them is the way they like it. Some want a weekly review, some want a monthly review. Some don't want a review as long as you're getting the results. Yep. So you can't say this is the way we serve and figure that everybody's gonna get service the way they desire. Oh, wait a minute now, that means desire is not in your world, it's in the customer's world. Ah. Fifth level of service is called surprising. It's when you do something unexpected and they like it. So it's like getting an unexpected gift. But the challenge with that one is not everybody values the same thing. Right. So somebody, let's say who values speed, you want to inform them the moment it happens. And they're going, man, I'm getting information from you in real time. That's what I like. Somebody else is going, why are you bothering me with this, man? <laughs> I mean, what I want is that one end of every two week review but the way I want it presented to me is the way I like to see it. And those graphs that you have and those forms that you use, it's just not like, I don't understand. I'm not user friendly. And then the, the smart digital marketing agency is said, well, that's okay. We know the data is gonna be the same, but how would it work for you for us to present this? Let me show you three different templates that we can do this in and let the client pick. And they're going, man, this is great. You know, those other digital marketing agencies, they were showing me the same data, but they just didn't take the time to think about how we'd like to see, ah, oh, surprising. The final level is when you blow them away. It's like, oh my God, service, right? And we call that unbelievable. unbelievable. So here's the thing about those six levels of service from criminal, basic, expected, desired, surprising, unbelievable. They're not stairs, it's not fixed. This son of a gun is an escalator always going down, which means the thing that you did that was unbelievable, it will be, but only the first time you do it. If you do it again, oh, nice surprise. You do it again, it becomes what they desire. You do it again, it becomes expected. After a while, it's basic. And if you don't do it, dude, you're a criminal.